Hello, what's up, Mr. Bobble here. In this video, I'm going to be taking a look at the Strip Knives Kevin Estelle collaboration that was sold through Fieldcraft Survival as a limited run. Now, this knife is being described as the modern take on the Puko design, and I was lucky enough to get my hands on one before they sold out in about five minutes. So stand by. <laughs> First of all, it comes in great packaging. You can see the Stroop logo and then the Fieldcraft logo. Uh, opening it up, see a QR code with Stroop's social media information, two Stroop stickers, and then a Fieldcraft sticker. And of course, the knife. It's very aesthetically pleasing. There's the Fieldcraft logo. Then on the other side is the Stroop logo. His texturing on the finish extends onto the spine, so it serves as great traction if you need to use your thumbs. And then you've got a square section for striking a ferro rod. And the blade length comes in at 3.4 inches, and then the handle length is 4.2 inches. Also, very nice sheath, has good retention, and then a nice steel clip. I'm gonna start by making some notches. Go ahead and blunt the end on this. Move to the number seven notch. This knife is very ergonomic. It feels really good. cabin notch and do a pell notch Cutting through this like it's butter. Don't really even need a baton. That turned out nice, and then just sharpen the end. This knife is gonna do really well for doing trap triggers and very intricate work, very nice. So now we're going to move on to a one stick fire.
Oh, this thing's sharp. can also hog off a lot of material with this blade. I made a good pile of shavings, and just to let you know, this wood's a little bit damp. As you can see, there's still snow on the log right there. Well, let's test out this spine. Almost there. What is there to say other than if it has Kevin Estella's name on it, it is going to cut effectively. And combining that with Chris's craftsmanship makes a heck of a blade. Feels good in the hand and is going to excel at any task it was designed for. If they make another run of these in the future, I would definitely recommend picking one up. And if not, still go check out Fieldcraft Survival for some in-depth training and some cool products. And check out Stroop because he'll have a blade for any taste. Thanks for watching and the links will be in the description.